hey, we have this problem on the board three of the x to the minus, x minus eight equals eight minus x. And I'm gonna solve this using the Lambert W function. This will be part of that playlist. So I'm only looking into solving by Lambert W. I'm not looking into any other methods. Start with our strategy. What we wanna do is we wanna be able to use this formula on the right to simplify this somehow, because when we have it in this formula format with the same coefficient and exponent, we then just return this same value. So W X E to the X equals X. And the problem with this here is we don't have an E in the problem. We have uh, base three, but there's an easy way to handle that. We can always turn uh, base three and, and uh, manipulate it so we have an E. So we can write this three as E ln three. And then just notice this is raised to the X minus, this three is raised to X minus eight. So we can just write this in like this equals eight minus X. And so again, with our goal in mind, let's get this on the right side of the equation. So it's going to be more similar to what we have over here. So if we divide both sides by this thing here, this um, exponential expression, on the left side, we'll have a one. On the right side, we'll have e to the eight minus x, e ln three, uh, x minus eight. But because we're dividing by it, we need a negative sign. But what I really want to do is take this negative one, and I don't want it on the ln, I want it on this because I want to get this expression to match and notice they're pretty similar so the negative sign is actually going to flip this so when I rewrite it we're going to have 1 equals 8 minus x e ln 3 8 minus x with the negative flipping it and so now we're really close to this format we want this piece here to be the exact same thing as this so we can use our formula and the way we can do that is we can just multiply through on both sides by an ln3, because we have that there, and ln3 on the left side. So now we're gonna have ln3 equals ln3, eight minus x, e ln3, eight minus x. And now we're exactly the same, so we can apply our Lambert W function to this. So now I just flipped the equation, I just felt like it that way, but um, we've applied Lambert W function on both sides, so then we're gonna just pull out this, this is gonna just return the input on the coefficient and exponents. So we're here we're gonna have ln three, eight minus x equals Lambert W ln three. But then we wanna just solve for x, so we can divide here by an ln three. On the left side, these will cancel. Then we can subtract and, I'm gonna rewrite in a second, we can just subtract an eight here to get rid of this eight and bring it over here. And then we're just going to multiply both sides by negative one to get rid of this negative. And then I'll write this just so it's a little cleaner. The next what I did is I plugged this in the Wolfram Alpha and I got a solution. We got 7.45219 with more decimals. And then what I want to do, I want all real solutions. And so the question is, how do we know that we found all real solutions is our more solutions? Um, and the key thing, let's just look at our Lambert W piece right here. The input on this is ln3. So we want to look that in decimal. That's approximately something around a little more than one, right? So let's look at the graph of the Lambert W function. Very rough graph, but if we look here around, this is like 1.1 or whatever it is, where our LN, this is, we'll say this is our ln3 value, but we can see that there's only one real value of the Lambert W function for the whole positive region, but particularly for ln3. Then just looking at the graph of our three to the x minus eight, I should use different colors, but this is our three to the x minus eight, this exponential curve, and then eight minus x is just a line with a slope of negative one. So it's pretty clear to see we have this one solution right here. I got this problem from my quiz, Lambert W Challenge. I'll provide a link in the description. A lot of problems like this. If you want more practice, please check that out.